Water is one of the most valuable resources on the planet. It is used for various applications such as recreation, washing, and drinking. The determination of water quality is vital to ensure that it is safe for consumption. To be classified as potable water, the water sample should contain zero microorganisms like coliform bacteria. Coliform bacteria are microorganisms found in the digestive tract and feces of animals and humans. They are also present in plants and soil. Coliforms do not necessarily cause illness, but are indicator organisms for the presence of disease-causing organisms. It is expensive and impractical to test for all possible pathogens in a water sample. Testing for coliforms is more effective since they originate from the same sources as pathogenic organisms, and the method is simpler and cheaper. Therefore, finding coliforms in a water sample signifies the presence of pathogens. Water collection. Medium preparation. An absorbent pad is placed in a petri dish, then nutrient broth is added. Sample preparation. The water sample is diluted, taking note of the dilution factor. The sample is then filtered through a filter membrane using a vacuum. Inoculation. The filter membrane is transferred into the petri dish. Incubation. The sample is incubated at 35 degrees Celsius for 24 hours. Microbial count. Count the red and blue colonies for the total coliform count, and the dark blue colonies only for the E. coli count. Since it is important to avoid further contamination of the sample and exposure to possible pathogen, this procedure is performed in an aseptic environment. Aseptic techniques and primary containment are used to ensure cleanliness and safety. ESCO Life Sciences offers a wide range of equipment designed to keep the area clean and the